Hi, Hamza here and welcome to this tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a coming soon or a maintenance mode for your website. And you know this comes in every time you're trying to set up stuff on your website or if you are just going to launch a new website. But in this case, when you're still in the development process and you don't want people to see whatever is happening or how you are making up your website or you are changing things. So this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to exactly add coming soon or maintenance mode using Elementor. You don't need to install another plugin once you have Elementor installed. To do that, you simply go to Elementor, then come to Tools. And once you are under here in the Tools section, come to Maintenance Mode. And in Maintenance Mode, we can choose a maintenance mode. Here it says, set your entire website as maintenance mode, meaning that this site is offline temporarily for maintenance or set it to coming soon mode, meaning the site is offline until it is ready to be launched. So here we can choose a mode. By clicking here, we can choose either coming soon mode or maintenance mode. Then here it says choose between coming soon mode, returning the HTTP 200 code or maintenance mode, returning the HTTP 503 code. So here we can add who can access the website even when it's in maintenance mode. So we can say maybe administrators, editors, authors, contributors, subscribers. Before we do that, we have to choose a template that we have to display to our visitors once they visit our domain. In this case, we are going to create a template. Let me just create one by clicking create one. We can name the template of our coming soon mode or maintenance mode. In this case, the name doesn't really matter. What matters is just giving it a name. Then we say publish. Once you have this published, it's basically saving your template that you're trying to create. Now we can say edit with Elementor. And now this will open us into another window. We are going to start creating our coming soon mode using Elementor. However, now it loads up using the default canvas where it shows our header and our footer. We don't want our visitors to see this once our website is still in maintenance mode, unless you like to. For me, I wouldn't. So in this case, I'm going to come here to settings. Then I'm going to change the page layout to Elementor Canvas. Okay, now this will take off all our headers and footers and will just remain with a blank canvas. Now this looks nice and neat. We can start creating our coming soon page. However, I will not do everything from scratch. Let me just close this over, come here over to the templates folder. Then we are going to borrow something here. Okay, I can just borrow this. So in this case, I'm importing a whole page but I'm going to delete all the other sections. Okay, now I have this and I'll change this to website, website coming soon. Okay, I can delete this other column. And then here I can add another section. I can just say, did -di ding add another section here and say feel free to reach us out on our social media platforms or via email at admin at maga reports dot com Okay, now I come here to the style, text color, change that to white, and then I can also increase a little bit on our text color, something like that. I can come over here to our widgets, then search for social icons, drag them over here, then we can only add social icons that we have for different platforms that we use, then we can add links to those specific social platforms, let me say HTTP is forward slash forward slash facebook.com forward slash go tech UG. Okay, so I can just copy that URL and then I can also do the same for all the other sections. This is twitter.com. Okay, I get that set up. Then I can decide to have these sections left aligned. 
I can also change the hover color here by selecting the button, go to style, come over to the hover color. The background, I'm changing it to something that is visible. Change here, boom, looks better. Now we can view that on a tablet. We can also view it on mobile. Then we can also adjust accordingly. We want this to be centered on mobile. And this should be centered on mobile to come back to our style alignment center website coming soon feel free to reach us on our social media platforms over email at that email or social media platforms here okay so I go back to the desktop mode and then I can simply update when I update let me preview we have now created our coming soon page we added our social handles we added an email so we can do a little bit more further edits we can change the background image to an image that we want by selecting the section come to style then we can change to an image that we wish to use do we use this here add it as our background image well and good works well and then we can now add our call to action. We can even add here a link to our chat platform or we can set it up and links up to Twitter or our messenger. Depends on what you want. So once you are done setting that up, simply hit update and then we can preview this. Boom, looks nice and sweet. So I'll just simply close this up and I'll say congratulations on creating your coming soon. So once we are done creating our template, we can simply come back to the tools and reload. Once the page reloads, come back here to choose the mode. In this case, ours is coming soon, but it depends on what you want to do. It can be maintenance mode. The only difference is the changes on the content you're going to put here and the code that will be displayed to Google. In this case, we want a coming soon and then who can access only the administrator who is logged in. So I will select custom and then I'll say only I want the administrator. But if you had already provided login details to the editor, author, and you want that in the process of developing the website, these other people can be also in position to access the website back end and they do their work, well and good, you can just simply check these boxes. But in this case, I want only me, the administrator, to be in position to access the website. And then here we can choose a template, and then we select the template that we created. Okay, so I can just say save. Now, when I have this saved, it means that our maintenance mode will be turned on. And now this means no one can access our website if they don't have login details into the back end of the website. Now, let me just copy this URL and open it in another window before the website could be accessed. Now, let me just open it again and you'll see what comes up. Boom! Website is coming soon so they can't see anything in the back end or what is happening on our website congratulations on creating a coming soon or even a maintenance mode for your website using elementor i hope this tutorial brought you value if you like the video please do all those things hit like subscribe comment share it's your life and also i'll be happy to know that you did all those things thank you so much for watching and see you in the next one peace